I knew I was smarter than my teachers. Not like I'm a narcissist, lunatic, egomaniac. My English teacher is doing life in jail for racketeering. It was just this mob town in New Jersey. Mr. Roma was my AP English class. I don't know how I was in an AP English class. He was the football coach. And you know, usually a coach or they let him coach like driver's ed, right? No, fucking, they put this mook at AP English. He's supposed to be reading like Brave New World, Lord of the Flies. We walk in, he's still dressed as a coach. He's got the comb over his fat Tommy. One of these Italian guys that breathes way too loud out of his nose. How you doing? Yeah. <laughs> Take your seats. All right. On the blackboard, this is all to the letter true, okay? He had written, in quotes, ignorance for the law is no excuse, close quote, and under it he wrote me, quoting himself. <laughs> we sit in our seats, and he goes, all right. Now, ignorance for the law is no excuse, all right? You just get it? No excuse. Ignorance for the law is no excuse. This is AP English. I'm Mr. Roma. You know me as Coach Roma? Probably, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you could do homework for other classes in here. Let's keep it down. Keep the vice principal out of our business. You know what I mean? Maybe put something over the window after I go. And uh, you could do other homework. You could nap. Hey, you could box. I don't give a fuck what you do in here. <laughs> just don't bring heat. This is what he said. Don't bring heat on me, all right? Bathroom passes are on the desk, sign in, sign out, on a system. I'm an adult, I don't need a pass. I'll see you February 2nd. <laughs> and he walks out of the fucking classroom. <laughs> Almost all the way out. Because Mike Slogar, one of the guys on my wrestling team goes, this idiot goes, what if I'm in another state and I don't know the speed limit? And, I, and we're all like, what the fuck are you talking for? <laughs> We just, we just got handed the conch, we're free, like. Because what if I'm in another state, I don't know the speed limit, and I'm driving, and that bumbling, like a tiny guy, all right, he turns around, ice cold, he goes, Slogar, are you a dumb guy? <laughs> yeah, it was creepy. And Mike Slogar, to his credit, starts scooching his desk, you just hear, Ugh. Er, like, he thought he was gonna attack him. It was that, and he wasn't wrong to think that, because we're like, scooching the other way forward, like, er, this is gonna be good. <laughs> this is true, by the way. He goes, hey, Slogar, are you a fucking dumb guy? <laughs> Mike Slogar goes, I'm, I'm not, I'm not a dumb guy, I'm not. And Mr. Roma goes, without taking his eyes off Mike, goes, JJ, what to say in the blackboards? These are tiny guys, they put an S on things that don't need an S. Oh, oh, good, you got my waters? All right. Mm. What's it saying, the blackboards? I go, uh, ignorance for the law. And as I'm reading, I realize there's an enormous crossroads for me personally coming up when I get to excuse. <laughs> By the way, he nailed the R in February and left out the X in excuse. <laughs> Ign I'm realizing that now. Ignorance for the law is no excuse. February 2nd. <laughs> wow. Hi, I'm back. I'm reading, I go, ignorance for the law is no, I go, fuck it, excuse. <laughs> but I had the fear. Without taking his eyes off a of mic, he goes, JJ's not a dumb guy. <laughs> Then he leaves. <laughs>